We start in Washington this morning. President Trump has revealed the U.S. recently had very positive correspondence with North Korea, adding that both sides are seeking to restart nuclear talks. Trump's top diplomat has also expressed hope the regime will take a different approach when they finally sit down again. Lee Sung Jae starts us off. Speaking to reporters at the White House on Monday, President Trump said his administration recently had positive correspondence with the North Koreans as they continue to work toward resuming talks on denuclearization. No, we just have a very good relationship, and probably they would like to meet, uh, and uh, we'll see what happens. There was a little correspondence recently, we're very positive correspondence with North Korea. Uh, again, there's no nuclear testing, there's no missile testing, there's no nothing. When they're ready, when they're ready, we'll be ready. With Pyongyang and Washington deadlocked over the stalled nuclear talks, the leaders expressed a willingness to resume talks in the near future during last month's historic meeting at the DMZ. However, North Korea warned last week that if the U.S. broke a pledge not to hold a military exercise with South Korea, the talks could be at risk. U.S. Secretary of State Mike Pompeo rejected the notion that military drills will breach any agreement between the two leaders. Seoul has also stated the military exercise will go ahead as planned next month. Pompeo said Monday that he hopes Pyongyang takes a different position when they resume nuclear talks. While he didn't elaborate on what that may be, he said the task is simple. Considering North Korean leader Kim Jong-un already committed to denuclearize during his first summit with President Trump in June 2018. Lee Seung-jae, Arirang News.